Cal, you're going to describe the steps for introducing, reinforcing, practicing, and extending the count on facts for addition. This coloured section shows the 64 count on facts out of a possible 100 facts. Before we, we talk about those steps, can you just uh, clarify for me what the count on facts are again? Well, as you said, it's all of those facts, but we can break them down into uh, smaller groups. Mm -hmm. We sometimes call this the count on cluster, mm -hmm. and then these are the subclusters. And one way might be to show you the separate cards that we used for those, so you can see what the what those subclusters are. So the cards that um, um, show the count on one facts are anything where you're adding a one. Yeah. So we have a number there. One add in, the other add in is one. And so we have a whole set of those uh, cards mm -hmm. that show the count on one, and that's one of the subclusters. Yes. And then we could have another set that we work with for the uh, subcluster that's the count on two. Mm -hmm. And um, there's obviously a two that we're adding, mm -hmm. where when we count on, it is, as we say, we take the first number and we don't have to count any of that. We just count one, two, yeah, and And I one. guess we'll talk about that later. So you're going to put this in your head and you're going to count on the two. Right. My question for you is, uh, is this a count on fact? Uh, y yes, we would classify that as part of the count on two subcluster, right. except we wouldn't want to start with the two and count on seven. No. We'd want them to see, and that's part of the teaching, mm -hmm. that we start with the greater number. Again, think the bigger number. Yeah, you count, count on small. Count on small. Right, so, so the count on two facts, so you do the count on ones, count on twos, twos, and I guess the turnarounds. And the turnarounds. And then the other, a third sub.